Okay, so in this video we're going to talk about press-ups. And um, press-ups are a fantastic exercise for a number of reasons. The, the main reason press-ups are so good um, is because you can do them anywhere. You don't need any equipment, so that'd be the second reason. And they're very easy to kind of progress or regress backwards and forwards, and, and they're pretty much accessible to everybody. Um, and in terms of what you work on with press-ups, you're working on um, upper body strength primarily, so you know, pectoral, chest muscles, deltoids, shoulder muscles, triceps, arm muscles. Um, but you're also working your core, front and back. And so really, when you, when you get really good at press-ups, they're a fantastic exercise for full body strength, full body conditioning in some way, um, and great for toning. Um, and then there's just that kind of goal a lot, a lot of people have to just be good at press-ups, you know, you know, it's an objective of, you know, maybe yourself to, to be able to do one or two or three or beyond, or make progressions from your press-ups, okay? I'm just going to demonstrate two, two press-ups for you now. One is the kind of longer lever press-up, that's kind of what the, the one that you'd be used to seeing and everybody doing, and then there's a regression you can look to do if that's not quite accessible for you at the minute, okay? So your long lever position, okay, press-up, so your standard press-up if you like, body weight press-up, off the toes, lower yourself towards the ground, t-shirt to the ground, and back up. Okay, and that's how that works. Now, with those press-ups, a couple of things that you want to keep in mind. When you set yourself up, you want to be mindful of where your elbows are, okay? So, uh, think about telling the time. If your elbows are in this kind of position, okay, pointed out, uh, it's this elbow's pointed out at 3 o'clock, this elbow's pointed out at 9. We really want to bring those elbows down to change the time, okay, to tell the time. And so this elbow's down more like 5 o'clock on the clock, and this one is down at more like 7 o'clock, okay? That's really important before you lower yourself down. Um, the other thing that's really important is that you breathe, breathe and you brace yourself for a punch to the stomach. So really create a bit of tension there and squeeze your, your butt muscles as well, okay? Um, if I was to put it another way for you, I would say, uh, pretend you've got a 50 euro note or a win a lottery ticket between those butt cheeks and don't let anybody take the, the 50 euro or the lottery ticket. Uh, and then the last thing is coming down nice and slowly under control, trying to, trying to land or, or land as softly as a balloon comes down towards the ground, uh, getting your t-shirt and shorts really close to the ground. Okay, so just talk you through it again. So, hand position like so, underneath the shoulders. Before you go anywhere, just check your elbows. So we're in this position here, we want to adjust the hands to bring the elbows in closer. Yeah, squeeze, brace yourself with a punch to the stomach, down towards the ground, t-shirt and shorts to the ground, and back up, and back up, and when you're finished, you stop. Now what's the regression for that? What's the step back from that one, okay? If this one here is a bit too difficult, all we need to do is put our knees on the ground, and from there, we're gonna do exactly the same thing, okay? Keep practicing your press-ups, keep working on your technique, look for progress over time, be consistent with it, and you should see big improvements on those. And like I said, it's a great strength building exercise. You don't need any equipment and you can do them anywhere. So best of luck if you need any help, uh, drop us a message and we'd obviously be glad to help you. Talk to you soon. Adios.